Hi guys, I hope you're all doing a one. Uh, <laughs> Hi guys, I hope you're all having a lovely day wherever you are, whichever part of the world you are. I hope you're all okay. Um, I just wanted to say hi, hello. Um, so I wanted to make this video to give all of you guys a tribute. Um, tribute basically means an act, statement, or a gift that is intended to show gratitude, respect, and admiration. So tribute basically means that uh, you know, um, kind of paying your respects to someone or telling them how good they were or you know just giving them giving them the boost they need you know like some of that thing so without further ado and i've got your names from alman hal you know like alphabetical order so if your name starts with an s or k or uh, k or e as well actually not e let me have a look who's the, who's the bottom person s o m yeah if your name starts with s o m or you know i'm sorry it'll take a bit of time um but it is what it is, man. I mean, S O M. It is S is always going to be down in the in the alphabet list, so you can't really change that. Um, okay, so before we start, first of all, actually, let's just start there. First of all, Abdullah Muhammad Ismail Ahmed. Let me actually put a time timer on as well, so I could, uh, you know, um, be on be consistent on time, and so I don't, uh, you know, over speed and stuff. Um, right. Three, two, one. Everyone will get one minute. No one's going to get more more than one minute. I'm going to set a timer here. Three, two, one. Start. Abdullah Muhammad Ismail, my friend, you have been the most improved student of my class. Term one till term three. It was a journey. Term term one we started like this. Term two like this. Term three went up, and inshallah, in university and everywhere you will you will go higher. I know. I know you have the potential, and. Uh, Term one, you were very shy. You were very, your confidence was a bit down, which is fair, which is okay. But guys, all of you guys, term one till term three, Abdullah Muhammad has has improved so much, and his grades are one of the best in the class. I think he got hundred percent in my class, and I'm very proud of you. And I don't treat you as a student anymore. I saw you as a little brother as well. You said, teacher, I see you as an, as, a, as an elder brother, and I see you as a little brother as well so well done on your result and i'm very proud of you inshallah you will go very high um yeah one minute's done now for abdullah sami muhammad okasha completely different person um abdullah muhammad abdullah sami sorry <clears throat> we've had our differences we've had um you know we never saw eye to eye we never saw um the same thing in the same way you know so that's why um Look, I know you want to go to Egypt, and I'm maybe maybe you are there, and I wish you the best of luck. And I know you can do things. You have the potential, and you have the knowledge, you have the power, you have the willpower, you have the energy. You can do it. <clears throat> you can do it. You've got it. Just make sure you don't give up. I saw you in the class as well, and I knew that uh, if you just get a little bit push, you can do it. And I hope you find something that's more sporty and, you know, like has more sports in it or maybe... Uh, I also hope you find good friends there in the university or wherever you go, like Mustafa Shireen or Khaled or Ayman, like... And I know you will do great. So, best of luck. Oh, there's a timer. Now we have... Hang on. I'm here. We have uh, Abdurrahman Ayman. Eamon, um, there's, a, there's a surprise for you in the end, by the way, Eamon, so please stick stick around. Um, actually, there's a surprise for everyone, so please, all of you, stick around. I've got something well, something for you. Um, Eamon, um, one of the smartest kids, I think one of the top five kids in my class. Honestly, you are very respectful, the way you would talk to me, the way you would answer me, the way you would you know talk to your friends. If I wanted to see you, I would see you how you deal with your friends and the way you talk to them, the way you help them bloody amazing and I'm very proud of you you're one of the smartest people in the classroom and um, I am more than more than happy to you know like be super proud of you you are going to go places inshallah and I'm sure wherever you go whoever is your teacher they should be proud of you because you have potential inshallah I can see you go heights I can see you do stuff that people wouldn't even do it's very like good stuff so I hate this timer, but yeah. Now we have Abdul Rauf. Abdul Rauf, my friend, it is very similar to 
Abdullah Muhammad Ismail. You have also improved a lot. Um, looking at your grades as well, I mean, you have you have considerably gone higher. And I, I would also like to say thank you to Raja, but I will come to you later. You have done you've done good. You're very polite, very nice. There is one person who said there is one famous saying, guys, that uh, I remember, and I and I remember when I was a student, I read that that politeness will get you places where education cannot. Do you understand? Politeness will take you to places where education will not. So to all of you guys who I say polite, I think that's more important than anything. So well done, Abdul Rauf. Amazing results. And I'm very proud of you as well. Very good. Well done. Amazing. Um, two, one. Okay, let's, let's, that's the time for that. Ah, I hate that. Okay, hang on. Um, then we have Abdullah Ali. Abdullah Ali, um, I hope you watch this video as well because most of the time, my friend, you didn't bring the book. But even when I, even when your friends and I tell you that we have an inspection tomorrow, but let's bring the book. Um, look, one of the best things about you is that you are very brave. I'm not even joking. In this classroom, when I see you get bullied, when people bullied you, you still stood up. You were very brave. You would stood up for yourself. I know it was hard and I know it's a very different environment. But still, my friend, you are a brave person. And for that, I would um, stand up and clap for you, but I'm wearing very horrible looking shorts, so I'm not going to do that. Um, but I would clap for you like this. When I was, and when I was in uh, high school as well, I got bullied a lot and I had to fight my bullies off. And I'm telling you, you will go places and it will not always be like this and you will do great. So. Keep on fighting and keep on being brave. Inshallah, you will do great wherever you go. Um, Abdullah Hamdan. Abdullah Hamdan is the first person in the classroom, probably the last one, whose name I always forget. Always, always, always I forget his name. He even jokes around. We all joked around like how I never remember his name. And uh, for that, I'm so, so, so sorry. I am very sorry that I kept on forgetting your name, but I know who you are and I know who, um, how you are in the classroom. And uh, yeah, you are also very respectful. Generally, grade 12 advanced has been one of the most respectful classes in the world, in my, in the world, maybe, but in the school, yes, 100%. And Abdul Hamdan, you're part of it. Very sweet. You did not mind that I forgot your name. You did never, you never had any problems with that. Also, even in the classroom, you would be very well behaved. Um, you would be, you know, polite, you would be working hard and you would also, you know, um, be helping other students out as well. So I would say for that, well done. And I just keep on helping your friends, keep on helping people. Right now, humanity could do with some help. So please, um, this is for all of you. Help your friends, help yourself, help your neighbors, help your mom, help your dad, help humanity. So these guys who I'm saying polite are doing that essentially. Thank you, Abdullah Hamdan. Um, we have, sorry, hang on, let's go back. Okay. Ahmed Abdul Rahman. Um, Ahmed Abdul Rahman, again, one of the smartest students in my class, only if you listen. Whenever you listened to me in the classroom, my friend, you were, you were going places. You were like that. This course was nothing for you when you were listening. You know, you're a talented boy. You're a very talented boy. You're a very smart boy. You know, there's a saying that says hard work beats talent when talent doesn't work hard. So with you, you're talented. You know, you don't work hard, but, but that talent little bit of hard work and I saw you you could do it take you there and I'm proud of you for getting a good result in the classroom and uh, for being polite I know I was a bit hard on you sometimes but this is only because to get you where you are and I'm proud of you and I'm sorry for being harsh but I'm very proud of you um, you're absolutely wonderful and uh, yeah just keep being you and keep being, uh, keep being the great person you are. The great and tall Abdul Rahman, Ahmad Abdul Rahman. 
Okay, now we have Ibrahim Ubaid, which we all, Ibrahim Ubaid, Ibrahim Ubaid al Kabi. Yes, which we all can agree he is the captain of the class. I did not even need to say it. This person is the captain of the class. He was the captain of the class. Honest to God, Allah, he is so, so sweet. He is the sweetest person in the. You know, when you see in movies, this big muscular guy, like strong guy, big strong guy, but his heart is very soft. He is so polite, so sweet. He would always ask, teacher, do you want water? I would say, Abdur, Abdur, uh, I take the money. Get, no, 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 teacher. No, why? He said, I'll get water for you. Always look after me. And even in the trip, I trusted Abdur, uh, Ibrahim Ubaid a lot. And you did not break my trust. One second, you never broke my trust. I trusted Ibrahim Ubaid for with the, the students of 12 and once, the other one. And you did not break my trust for that. I'm very thankful. And uh, you will also... You will also do great things in the future, I know. Just keep being you, keep being polite. You are the leader of the classroom. And a leader is not a boss. Because everyone has to do what a boss is, but everyone follows a leader because they want to follow. And that is you, Ibrahim. That is you. And no one can take that away from you. So well done. Amazing work. Um, sorry. Um, next one is Ibrahim Saber. Ibrahim Saber future doctor inshallah and uh, I really hope that you do great polite again very sweet um, little bit careless but when you grow up when you will be going to university or wherever you even army or police or wherever you're going the carelessness will, will go away trust me I was I was more careless than any one of you trust me I would lose everything every day so you will inshallah do well I know and if you need a reference from me uh, for University of Manchester or University of Nottingham or wherever you want to go for medicine, I'm here. Um, say that's my number, Khamis has my number. Some of you have my number. Message me and I'll send you a reference straight away. And I'm very proud of you as well. You got a good result as well. And a uh, little bit of hard work, you're going there. But again, one of the most polite people and most hardworking people of 12 Advanced One, Ibrahim. Uh, Saber. Um, next one is Hamdan Rashid. Hamdan Rashid, my friend, a sweet boy, very polite, um, sitting in the front, always smiling. When I see Hamdan Rashid in the class, I am also very, uh, I feel peaceful. You know, when you, there are some people in the world, when you look at them, you're having a bad day maybe, or you're sad, but when you look at these people, or when you talk to them, you just brighten up. You're like, oh, thank God, I need that energy. Ibrahim, sorry, Hamdan Rashid is one of those people. Please take care of him. Sits in the front, smiles. Um, very nice, very sweet. Always has his books. I have never had any problems with Hamdan Rashid in terms of books, workbook, or participation. Never. If I put him in a group, he will say, okay, teacher, yes, teacher, when do you want them? And, you know? That is... The sign of being a very great student and inshallah you will go places i know it just keep on working hard and uh, keep on uh, keep on being polite as you are keep on smiling we all need that especially now in these times so amazing my friend amazing okay um we also have um hamdan saif musabba now hamdan saif musabba again with you, um, let's say a bit of hard work can go a long, a long way. It's not like you're you don't know or something. It's like just a little bit of hard work. The topic we did in the classroom wasn't hard, but I like that even if you did not get the answer, you wouldn't give up. I like that about you, and that is something very unique. A lot of people when they don't know the answer, they wait for the teacher. They oh, oh, halas, something will the teacher will tell us no. With you, you're not like that. You are a different person. You are like, teacher, okay, I, even if it's the wrong answer, you keep on trying. You know, it's like uh, finding Nemo. When Dory just keeps swimming, swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. That's you. So, well done. Amazing. And just keep on being the way you are. And inshallah, you'll go places. So, 
Thanks, my friend, and I hope you have a wonderful future wherever you go. Um, <laughs> I keep on messing about. Ah, Khalid Saru. Honestly, um, there are a few kids, few people in, in the classroom who I see eye to eye and who know where I'm coming from and who I can have this connection with without even talking. You know, there are people in the world when you don't even need to talk to them and you, you can have this eye to eye connection and you know what they're saying and they know what you're saying. So, Khalid is one of them. One of the smartest people in the classroom. One of the most logical students in the classroom. Khalid, the way you see what, see things and you, the way you see the world, I really love it. I really respect that. Whenever you would bring up a an answer to a question, but your way would be different than mine, I still loved it. Because that means you're thinking, you're using your brain. You're not like sheep or you're not like, you know, just following me around. And I like that. You would challenge me, teacher, why is this like this? And I would love it. I would love a good challenge. I would love people challenging me. Um, you're one of them and I'm very proud of you. I'm going to go a little bit higher on that because you deserve it. And your result is hands down without any doubt. I mean, you got 100%. Um, but yeah, and I'm proud of you. Inshallah, 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 you will do well wherever you go, whichever university you go to. And uh, stay in touch if you need any help. I'm always here for you, even if I'm not teaching or if, even if I'm back in England, I'm here for you. Okay, so do whatever you want. Do well, be positive like you are, help your friends like you always do. And wherever you go, help them, help them. Trust me, students, all of you, trust me. Um, friendships will stay with you for the rest of your lives. Studies will come and go. Universities, colleges will come and go. Friends remain. Yeah, so Khaled, I know you keep your friends together, you stay together like you always do. Right, um, Khalifa Muhammad, hmm, the hacker, the famous hacker Khalifa. Um, I remember one day you said, teacher, I can hack your laptop. I'm like, it's not even my laptop, it's a ministry's laptop. You hack it, Habibi, you hack it right now. Um, but super polite, super nice, super sweet. Um, very skinny, very tall. Actually, not very tall, but very skinny. Yeah, I remember, but still, it doesn't matter if you're skinny or tall or short. If you're a nice person, that's all. That's all it is. And again, um, Khalifa, sweet, nice, hardworking. If he doesn't know the answer, okay. Sometimes you wouldn't come to me, but sometimes you would go to your friends, and they would explain it to you. Sometimes we have to go to our friends because they do a better job in explaining than the teacher does. That's an obvious thing. So yeah, Khalifa, well done on a great result, and uh, inshallah you will be going places as well. You're great. You're a great student. I'm very proud of you. Um, next one is Khamis. Ha, ah, Khamis, Khamis, Khamis. How can I not give you a tribute? The oh my god, I don't even, I don't even know. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Um, with Khamis, again, one of the smartest students in the classroom. If he works. If he doesn't go to Mr. CDI, Mr. Uh, what's his name, Mr. Faris in his CDI office, teacher, in my class, teacher, I'm going to the lab. Okay, yalla, Habibi, you go. You go to the, you go to Scotland. You go to China, Habibi. I, as long as you know what you're, what you will do afterwards, you know. Sorry, we couldn't go for the trip, and I really wish you could have gone next in the stages. You know that competition you were wanted to go to, um, but I would say I hope that I, I know that you are going to shine for the UAE and I can see you in the national uh, government one day I can see you and I know you will be there and I know actually I'm, I might even say that you might be famous one day inshallah 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 you have the courage you have the potential you have the energy just use it keep on using it because we, we knock at many doors sometimes they're closed sometimes they're open if a thousand doors are closed one is open Hamis is the type who will keep on knocking, 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 knocking. Trip, 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 trip. <laughs> so, amazing work. And uh, yeah, it was a very, it was an honor teaching you, it was a privilege teaching you, and I had fun teaching you. And I hope you all um, enjoyed it as well. Now, we have Mayid. Mayid, Mayid, Mayid. <clears throat> Hang on. I'm sorry I couldn't add you in Call of Duty. I, 
I am open to playing Call of Duty with you now. Um, add me anytime you want. But with my polite student, well, uh, very polite, very sweet. Never, I never had any problems with you. You had the books, you had um, everything. Um, cheating could be a bit of a problem, but a little bit, not much. And uh, yeah, I'm very happy with your results. You're very great. A good student in my class, and I enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoyed it as well. But, uh, and I don't know what your future plans are, but wherever you go, keep on being mild, keep on being polite, keep on being sweet. Because I know you can do it, you can do whatever you want. So, yeah. Um, <clears throat> now we have Muhammad Ibrahim Muhammad Ali. Hang on. Muhammad Ibrahim. Again, on the, on the left side, um, you were there and uh, I know we didn't talk that much because you were on that side, but um, I do know that you were again a polite person, a decent boy. Never had any problems with me, I never had any problems with you. Um, inshallah, wherever you go, just be positive. Try to make friends, try to make friends who are also helpful, so you can help them, they can help you, because that's how we, that's how the world works. Um, but yeah, stay positive, stay great, and uh, again, I wish I could have gotten to know you a bit more but again maybe that's how it is that some people you know like you just they are very low profile they just keep to themselves which is fine I, I was like that at one point so yeah well done on your amazing 100% I think you got 100% so yeah <clears throat> now we have <clears throat> Muhammad Said <clears throat> sorry Muhammad Said um, again that side not much interaction but polite because I know I went to you most of the side, most of the, went to that side a lot. You wouldn't be shouting, you wouldn't be screaming, you wouldn't be, you know, making a fuss or making a mess in the class. You would have your books, and that's all I cared about. And also, I cared about you getting knowledge, and you did. And that's that's reflected in your result. So I'm very proud of you as well. And uh, just be polite. If you can't do, if you guys can't do anything, be polite. Be nice. So again, Muhammad said was polite, was nice, and I'm very happy with that. Even at least in my class. So yeah. Um, next is Muhammad Ahmad Al Hussein. <clears throat> Muhammad Ahmad Al Hussein, um, Abdullah Ismail's best friend. Uh, Muhammad Ahmad, I can easily say you are one of the most bravest boys ever, and you're one of the most helpful people in the class. One of the most helpful people in the class. Term one. You helped, uh, what's his name? Uh, you helped Muhammad, you helped, you helped Abdullah Ismail a lot. Term one, I can, I know it, I know it. And yeah, I know he's your, he's your best friend. And Abdullah Ismail, you're a lucky person to have Muhammad as your best friend. Muhammad, now, you're a lucky person to have Abdullah Ismail as your best friend as well. But very sweet, very genuine. Always caring about his results. And I know some, I think one, one or two times, even after the pop quiz, you came to me and I had to give you some extra questions to give your marks up, which I love to do because I want you all to get good marks. So you're very polite about it. And I really respect that. And uh, you're a very, very good friend, a truly amazing friend. So, yeah. Um, next is Mustafa Shireen. And I think we're coming to the end. Mustafa Shireen, I, when I said your name in my mind, I would say Dr. Mustafa Shireen. I don't know why. It just sounds very, you know, like some people when you see the see their, say their names, it sounds very doctor, like, you know, Dr. Mustafa. It sounds very good. Um, with health sciences, you are very smart. You are one of the best students of my class, hands down. And I picked you for my team as well. You know, when I was picking the team for the competition, I closed my eyes and picked you. I closed my eyes and I picked you because I know you were going to be great. And uh, yeah, you are a very helpful helpful person wherever you will go that place will be lucky to have you my friend you that place will be very lucky to have you in their uh, place or whatever so well done amazing work and I it was an honor for me to teach a smart boy like you and uh, I hope you enjoyed it as well but yeah well done amazing super and uh, how they say in Arabic uh, Mumtaz yeah now we have <laughs> Muhammad Ahmad Raja. By the way, Mustafa Shirin and Muhammad Muhammad Ahmad Raja, stay stick to the actually all of you guys stick to the end because I have some I have an announcement to make. 
and I have some memes for you as well. Some memes, yeah. Mohanad Raja, again, very smart. Uh, you helped a lot. You helped me a lot. Not only Abdul Rauf, you helped me a lot because sometimes when I was getting stuck in terms of explaining something, your Arabic would be very helpful and you would explain it to your friends. So I loved it and it was very great. It was very, it was brilliant. Super polite, very nice. When I'm teaching in class, I would look at you because I know your understanding and I know I could trust you in terms of getting the content. But uh, sometimes you would be helping your friends out in the exam, you know, like uh, when I'm looking at you, you're like, oh, is that I'm looking at you? Oh, oh, yeah, that's very, I, I don't know this person. <laughs> so that's fine. Now it's over now, so it's okay. But that time I was, I couldn't, I couldn't, you know, like um, let you cheat. That's not who I am. But now it's okay. It's funny now. But you're smart, you're great, and inshallah, inshallah, it is my belief that you will do amazing, wonderful wherever you go, whichever place you go, whichever university you go, whatever thing you like, you will do great, inshallah. And I'm hopeful that uh, um, you have a bright future ahead of you. Now we have Ubaid Umar. Ubaid Umar, hang on, just uh, Ubaid Umar again, the other side, not really talkative, but you had your books. Even in the assessments that I had, and even in the you know, observation I had, you know, when Jenny, that lady came into the class, you had your stuff. And that's all I wanted. And you were good in the class. You weren't talkative. You weren't misbehaving. And uh, I am proud of that. I'm very happy about that. You know, like it's, it's very, it's proper good that you weren't misbehaving and polite. You're sweet. You will go places because if you're polite and sweet, sometimes when you're not understanding things, people are like, okay, this person is nice. Knowledge isn't, you know, education, studies aren't the end of the world. Being a nice person is, and you are one of them. So, hands off, uh, hats off for you. Um, then we have Omar Jamal. Again, Omar Jamal. Um, a genius. I would call him a genius in the class. Um, gaming is uh, his forte like he loves gaming i love gaming as well by the way there's an announcement at the end by the way it's about something so please watch it um if you focus a little bit more in the class dude you're going high um you're going places my friend and i'm proud of you as well and please i know it was hard for you sometimes but just a little bit more effort can take you places but you are polite you're sweet you're nice and you're a genius so as I said, you're talented, little bit of hard work, you are going places. So well done on an amazing result. And I know you will be amazing wherever you go. Just a little bit of hard work. Dude, dude you're, going, you're going like a rocket, dude. <laughs> little bit of hard work though. Little bit. Um, hang on. Now we have Osama. Osama Muhammad, only person in the class who I would say I had a little bit of an issue with, a little bit, um, a bit talkative um, in terms of work, he had some problems, but being talkative meant that you would be polite as well, you would be sweet as well. When I would scold you and I'd be like, Sama, what are you doing? Like, Sama, please be quiet. You would argue, you would not argue with me, you would not be misbehaving with me, you would not be rude with me, and you would be polite, you would be nice, you would be like, okay, okay, so I'm sorry, teacher, I'm sorry. Yeah. That's all I want to do here, and I'm okay with it. And uh, I know you're a talking boy, but that's not a bad thing. Sometimes that's a good thing. I wasn't, I wasn't talkative in the school, in, in, in my time, and I wish I was. And you're talkative, that's a gift, and please use it for a good purpose. Maybe there's a higher purpose for you. Maybe God has a different plan for you, and inshallah it will be a good plan because I know you're a polite person, and I know you're, you will go places. A little bit of hard work and... Uh, little bit of a uh, little bit of less talking might help but I'm, I'm all i'm saying is keep on working hard that's what i'm saying you're great as well um then we have said rashid said hmm, we have to just put three minutes on that because i won't stop talking about it um said rashid said now with said said i wouldn't call you a student now I would call you my younger brother. I always saw you as my younger brother. I never saw you as a student. I'm confessing now. 
I always saw you as my younger brother and you were very helpful. I think the most help, the most helpful person in the class was Sayyid with me, uh, my interpreter, interpreter or my translator. Um, but yeah, again, I can't begin to explain how amazing you are. You know that already. <laughs> um, all I can say is best of luck in the future. Well done. And I'm always here for you if you need anything. Even if I'm not teaching, if I'm in the UK, I am always here for you. You'll never forget that. Um, but yeah, amazing work. Well done. And uh, I hope you have uh, the best of time wherever you go, whichever place you go. And I hope health sciences was fun for you. I tried my best, guys. I tried my best to make health sciences fun for you. But uh, I hope it was. I hope you guys learned something. And I hope you can teach others because as Master Yoda in Star Wars said, uh, pass on what you have learned so pass it on only thing you shouldn't pass on is the coronavirus because that's bad <laughs> um <clears throat> now we have last second last we have Sohail Ali um Sohail Ali Ubaid Muhammad Al Yamahi again Sohail polite very sweet and uh, didn't have any problems with you at all you always had the books you always had your items you always had things and I had no problems and genuinely I was very happy very proud of uh, how things went and how things rolled and you are a part of that and then we have Suleiman Ubaid again Suleiman Ubaid Ali Ubaid Salami got good result as well Suleiman and I remember Suleiman Ubaid being uh, one of those guys you know when you mess up a pop quiz you would come teacher teacher I want to get the marks yeah dude great you would I would give you questions and you would still you know get the good marks and that's what I love hard work you're a hard worker literally give some of the hard work to the people i mentioned in the, in the previous uh, names you're a hard worker and hard working people they go high and i know you will as well so well done excellent work and this is a tribute to all of my amazing grade 12 advanced students and i hope you all had a lovely time with me stick to the end because there's uh, some there's a surprise for all of you guys please 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 watch it um there's a surprise for you in the end do watch it um it's it's amazing it's amazing you will like it but thank you all for watching i hope you all have a lovely rest of the term or the rest of the li rest of your life or whatever you guys do and stay in touch let me know what you're doing or if you want any help anyone i'm here so salam alaikum guys peace and i will inshallah see you sometime soon in the future take care hi guys so this is one of the tributes i wanted to give you um these are some of the memes i made for all of you guys well one two three one two three four five six seven eight people um because i think they were we had some moments in the class so i think this is kind of something that reflects that um before i do that i would like you all to if please again um i'm trying to get to twitch affiliate status which is which basically means that i need to get some more followers so if you guys could go on twitch t-w-i-t-c-h dot tv and if you could go to slash alisip which is a l i s i b t and follow me just give me a follow uh, i basically game sometimes so if you want to play with me as well feel free like i love people when they play with me and sorry my I, I wish i could play with you as well but send me an invite i'm free these days why not let's play um yes please guys if you could go to twitch.tv slash alisip i'm trying to get the affiliate status which is uh it gives me gives me some more perks and gives me some more options on my Twitch. That would be amazing. And tell your friends, tell your neighbors, tell your neighbor's dog, tell your neighbor's cat, tell your grandma, tell your friend. I I, I don't know. Okay, um, right. So these are the memes that I wanted to show you. But please give it a follow as well. First of all, Abdul Rauf. Um, when Abdul Rauf, this is Abdul Rauf, and he's not when I'm not looking at him. He's looking around everywhere. And this is Abdul Rauf when I look at Raja. When I look at Raja, Abdul Rauf is like, yeah. Um, next one. This is for Abdullah Ali. Um, Abdullah Ali, I will not bring the books. I mean, I will not bring the books or draw 25. He picks 25 cards. Abdullah Ali, my friend, we have had so much problems with the books, but all's gone. All's okay. You, you did great. Again, Abdullah Ali, <laughs> this is, I will not bring the books. The books are not going to school. Abdullah Ali is like, which one should I press? So this is again one of those things which are very um, meme-worthy. Ah, this is my favorite. 
Eamon, when he looks, when he knows the answers, but looks at it, looks, looks at his friends, you know, like he knows the answer. Abdul Rahman Eamon, he knows the answer of the question. Most of the time, he didn't know the answer, and he would look at his friends and like, yeah. Um, Khalid, when he gets the answers right every time, Khalid's like, yeah, cheers, teachers, I got the answer. Halal cheers, halal cheers, guys, not halal. Yeah. <laughs> When Khamis asks for chips, this is me. This is actually me. Like, shut up, shut up, shut up. Dude, I'm sorry you couldn't go on the trip, but uh, um, it is what it is, man. I mean, I'm sure you're going to go on loads of other trips yourself. And I hope you find loads of uh, good friends. And uh, yeah, just have fun, man. Be friends with females as well. I know you've got loads of female friends as well. So just kind of, you know. <laughs> uh, Omar Jamal, knowledge? or gaming in class knowledge or gaming in class we don't know the answer to that okay Said and Raja when I actually see them helping their mates and I look at honest to God these two when I would look at them in the classroom and I would see both of them Raja and Said helping their friends out I most of the time I wouldn't see Said because he was sitting in the front but Raja when I would stare at you and I would look at you, I saw you help up the rope. I saw you help uh, the other side. But you'd like, oh, it was me, teacher. I have no idea. I have never seen this man in my life. <laughs> ah, and this one. Mustafa Shireen, when I asked him to stop helping Abdullah Sami. I mean, I, literally, Mustafa Shireen, you are one of Abdullah's best mates, best friends. And when I ask you to stop helping him, you'd be like, I don't know who this person is. I have never met this man in my life. Like, I don't know who this guy is like. <laughs> I kind of knew. At that point, guys, there have been so many times when I wanted to laugh out loud and be like, guys, come on, it's just a joke. Like, don't, don't, like, I'm, I'm just joking. But obviously, I can't. So, this is again part of the ending, which is uh, about memes that I made for you guys. But yeah, this is the last one. Again, guys, if you would give this a follow, um, twitch.tv slash alisip and get your friends get your neighbors get anyone you can please i'm trying to get a status on twitch which is if you get more followers you get this twitch affiliate status which allows you to do more streams and do more options and uh, um, do other stuff twitch is basically a platform for people who play games and they stream online so they actually when they're playing their games they uh, broadcast them and people from all over the world can see them so i, th I think most of you know what twitch is anyway so yeah on with the show and I will see you inshallah sometime soon in the future. This is the last bit of the video and I hope you all have a lovely day. Peace.